Hello and welcome along and welcome to another time lapse on Fenton Forest. Today we're getting started on our cotton harvest. Uh, we're using our cotton harvester here that we picked up the last uh, couple of episodes ago. And uh, I'm going to see how far this will go at the moment. I want to 10% of the way through. That's really good. So uh, hopefully we're going to get a few bales off this field. Uh, but yeah, we're going to leave this and let this get started on here. But certainly we should do fairly well. Uh, what we do need is we need a way of getting the bales from the field to the side of the field. We need a way of... Uh, getting them so it's easily accessible by our truck and our cotton trailer so in order to do that we're going to go and pick up the one piece of cotton technology we still uh, we don't have and that is this this is the module 4 trailer uh, so yeah this is basically what we'll use this for is we'll sit on the side of the field with this and when our harvester unloads a cotton bale uh, we can easily pick it up with this bring it to the side of the field and then it's easily accessible for our uh, truck to come along later and that keeps our field clear uh, we also have here our sunflowers are ready to harvest so we'll get our CR1090 started on that uh, we then need to get our 8RT uh, up onto the field as well because we're going to be overloading the sunflowers with that and then finally we get our truck with our gravity trailer uh, set up there too Drop the bucket off this and put the forks on because we want to sort the wool pallets out. Um, however, I don't think there is a flatbed trailer available uh, for our truck. So what I'll have to do is I'll have to see if I can get a mod of that uh, and we'll sort out the wool pallets next time. Uh, instead, let's clear up the cows. Uh, they not taking the silage. Let's unload our first load of sunflowers uh, quickly we'll keep this combine going there we go so part this down here for the next load uh, and yes so the silage uh, doesn't go into the cows because uh, the cows already have a full thing of silage there we go that sorted the sheep out as well uh, before we sort out the pigs though we have nearly a full cotton a full cotton bale done so let's just follow this harvester for a moment uh, 98 99 there we go full cotton bale off so let that go again and we'll get our module 4 trailer now yeah and get that loaded up there we go perfect so unload this and then go and check out ah no our sunflowers are nearly full again but our auger is into the crop so what we'll have to do is get the combine full back it out like that and bring up our overloader trailer and get that filled from there uh, once that's done we can get our combine started again and we'll go and empty our overloader into our truck and leave that going back to cleaning our animals so there we go cleaned our pigs out uh, we actually need to clean the chickens out as well but I forgot to do that at the time uh, and all of our animals actually could do with a top up of their water uh, the pigs especially so what we'll do is we'll back our water trailer in we'll give it to the cows late, uh, last because the cows tend to drink more than everything else so we'll do horses pigs and sheep there we go uh, Get our overloader lined up because our combine is nearly full again and there we go get that unloading on this row uh, on this route really nice yield on these sunflowers those have worked out very well uh, so empty the rest of that to the cows we'll top up because the cows did need a little bit more there we go not much more though only another 10 percent of our water bars are, so that's okay that's all done uh we need to get started now on sorting the rest of the, uh sorting field two out and getting it ready to uh replant so we're gonna get the we're gonna take the we've taken the jewels off we've got the cult flower on the back does this field need uh plowing no it doesn't so uh let's put the cultivator on as well 
And the reason for that, the counterplow would work, but the cultivator is wider, um, as you'll see in a moment. Uh, get the sunflowers unloaded again, and there we go. Hook up our cultivator and get that back to our field. There we go. Right, we've got almost got another cotton bale, but let's get the sunflowers harvesting again. And we've got the overloader to unload as well. It's at 91%, uh, so we might as well do that. We're going to unload our truck in a moment as well. Cotton harvester has unloaded the second bale, and there is less than a third of the field left. So that is not going to be another full cotton bale we get off here. But let's go empty our sunflowers into the silos. So that's good more than we're gonna have more than one truckload off that field so that is absolutely brilliant I right, get that back in position take our overloader back and our combine is at 70% so that's gonna need to unload before that row uh, is finished let's go get our manure spreader and get field one turned around so we're going to yeah fertilize this with manure because manure is a lot cheaper uh, than uh, than everything else or than uh, sort of standard solid fertilizer let's unload those sunflowers again and we'll switch our 6r uh, now on to the cotton trailer i don't think we're actually going to end up using the 6r with that but in future i think that would be the better piece of kit to use now our Samson and we need to load that up for, with manure. Manure is uh, loading this with manure is now a constant job once you start this. It is uh, does about a row and a half this uh, manure spreader. So we may have to look and see if we can get a larger manure spreader I think. Last two rows of cotton now uh, and we are at 51% so we are over half a bale so that's good news. Uh, these bales are worth a fair amount, I think. So having uh, having over half a bale is going to bring us in a nice amount of money. There we go, 60%. Uh, but we're going to have to go back and unload our combine for its last row. So uh, this will this should actually get fairly close to filling up our overloader. 92, 93. Uh, Coming to the end of the row now and 97% absolutely fantastic uh, that is gonna half fill our trailer and so one and a half trailers off uh, there uh, last cotton bale uh, as I said 62% on that uh, so that's good so park that back in the shed uh, we'll go and get our combine off the field, although I think our manure spreader has finished again, so we need to go and top that up. Yeah, it is a constant thing to keep this manure spreader topped up. There we go. Uh, and we'll keep that going. Away it goes. Cultivator is done, so we'll go and put that away. And, uh, and I think we might go and put the planter on this and get this this field planted so back on with the big jewels and then on with the great plains and we'll get this loaded up with some seed put our module 4 trailer away I said I said I didn't think I was going to be carting any cotton bales with that 6R and with that out of the way uh, we can go and get this seed we're going to put soybeans in field 2 this time so away that goes and we need to go and top up our manure spreader again. Uh, yeah, definitely need a bigger manure spreader for this field. There we are. Uh, get that going. And then we get our combine put away, uh, our overloader and our truck and trailer. In fact, no, I think we'll go, I think we'll go and sell our cotton bales. So that we, once we get these away, we should be able to free up our truck and go and sell our cotton bales. So overloader away and we'll hook this up to the cultivator because that will be useful on field one. First, we need to once again fill up the manure spreader. There we go. And back to the field with that. It's a good way through the field now. Um, there's not that many uh, more times we'll have to fill that up. We got a cultivator up to the field and get that started. 
there we go. Uh, the Cedar is doing great guns there. Need to fill up our manure spreader once more. There we go. And then well, that, that frees us up to go and drop or go and empty actually our remaining sunflowers out of this. Uh, and then we're going to go and sell the cotton bales. So we'll drop this trailer off. Grab our cotton trailer. And head back. And around here and load up these cotton bales. Like so. Oh, not quite got the hang of loading those in. There we go. Uh, one more thing of manure. And that will then be this field finished off. And then finally, let's go and sell these cotton bales. So we currently have four and a half thousand pounds. Uh, let's see how much these uh, give us. Hopefully it'll be a good amount. I want to get, we've got a small loan at the moment. I want to get that sold off or get that paid off. Sorry. Uh, 96,700 pounds from two cotton bales. So uh, with our other one at 60 uh, or 62 percent. That's going to be uh, another nice little top up. Manure is finished. No more top ups from that. So let's go and put this away. Back in its shed there. And then we're going to use some solid fertilizer next time on the uh, on <laughs> the soybeans that we've just finished planting. Uh, so we're going to get this. We're going to use this on the other field. We're going to put cotton in uh, this field actually. And we'll get that going next time. For now, though, that is where we are going to end this video. So all that remains is for me to say thank you for watching. I hope you have enjoyed this video. Please give it a like, drop us a comment, and give it a share. And for all the latest videos from Virtual Farmer, please subscribe to the channel and ring that bell. And I will see you next time. Goodbye.